Hi, and welcome to Late Night Journalism with me, your host, Luke Ma. And my guest tonight will be John Mantonona, Kamaikin, sports editor and extinguished sport writer. Come on in, John. Thanks for coming to the show tonight. Thanks for having me, Luke. Alright, let's get right to business. First question on people's mind, what credit can I get for this class? Now, I understand seniors next year are the only ones who can get journal or can get English credit, is that right? That's true. But for the non seniors to take the class, they can get a CTE credit, occupational aid credit, or an elective credit for taking the class. So it's a win win for seniors and non seniors. Well that's good. Wow. What did this class do for you as a writer? Now, did it improve your writing skills, improve your editing skills? How did it how did it enhance you? Well, as a writer previously, I didn't really go into much detail. I didn't really understand how to write, and I see that now. But as an editor, when I used to edit papers, I used to edit my own papers or other people's papers, I just kind of went through it and was like, I think this you, is you it. You didn't really know what you were doing. You are yeah. just kind of like, I don't know what to do. Just kind of wing, write some random red marks on the paper, make it look good. Yeah, and you know, I pretty much just winged it. But now, I know exactly what I'm looking for. And I'm, as I'm reading those papers, I can just make the good adjustments and just make them better. That is good. Now, have you seen improvements and the writers that have worked underneath you as well, and the other people's papers that you've edited, have you helped them out improve their own writing skills? Oh yeah, being an editor, I get to edit a lot of the, a lot of the articles that are put into the sports section and on the online paper. So, as I'm looking through these articles, you know, I used to just make a whole bunch of corrections in the beginning of the year, but now, they're learning how to write just like I'm learning how to write, and so, there's a lot less corrections that need to be made. We're all writing with precision, and it's really fun to see. Yeah. Now, I heard people are like, journalism, is that, well, there's only writing parts in that class, right? But there are really many jobs we can have in journalism. What are some of those jobs that we can have besides just writing? Well, we have photographers, we have people who work with InDesign, Photoshop, people who are, work with videos, so videographers, graphic design people, newspaper layout people, and there are also multiple types of writers, such as sports writers, entertainment writers, opinion writers. So all of that just factors into the class and yeah. the jobs. And also, like we said, we have an online newspaper. So if you're interested in doing online work, great, we got a great job for you. Now, with your personal experience with this class, do you feel like it's an overly difficult class, or do you feel like it's pretty laid back, pretty easy? Uh, how, how do you feel this class is? Well, it's not an overly difficult class. Anybody can do it. But one difficult part is the deadlines. Because when you write an article, it, there's a lot of work that goes into it. You need to take pictures for online, you need to take pictures and videos, you need to get background information, you need to get quotes, and then you still have to write your article. So. Meeting the deadlines can sometimes be difficult, but in the end, once you get it and meet the deadline, it really is nice. Now, about the deadlines, this, this isn't an overly structured class. You don't have the teacher harping on you, get, you gotta get this done, you gotta get this paper done, you gotta get this paper done. She expects you to have the responsibility to go and be able to finish your own work and be able to get it in on time. It's just not structured in that sort of way that you would have a normal like AP class, or, per se. Yeah, definitely. There's a lot of, you know, get this in by this time, and she depends on you to do it. There's not going to be a whole bunch of reminders. Right. Now, before we leave, do you have anything you'd like to add to this great information we've gotten tonight? Yeah. Well, as I said previously, article writing is pretty fun. And I put in a whole bunch of work into the article, and when it goes into the newspaper or the online time I talk, it's really nice seeing my work published and being recognized by the public. Also, I really enjoy working with the people in the class. I'm, this is my first year in the class, and I'm not as familiar with InDesign and Photoshop, and so whenever I need help with those, there are people in the class that I feel comfortable saying, hey, can you help me out? And they always do, which is really nice. Oh, that's great. Now, thank you guys for tuning in to our show tonight. And John, thank you for being here tonight. Well, We're glad we could have you. Thanks for having me, Luke. Well, tune in next week to Late Night Journalism.